Hi, good morning. Blake Shepard here at Cambridge Fitness. Just want to take you guys through a little flexibility flow this morning. Make sure you clear your area, you have enough room to move around, arms and legs. We won't really be moving out of the little like six by six box, so your living room is fine, coffee table out to the side. Make sure you're not going to hit your pets. Here we go, let's begin. Start off with just your upper body. Shifting your weight left to right. And moving your arms, criss and cross, one arm over the other, and alternate each time. And now just keep your arms apart and lightly rotate from side to side. Opening up your chest, get some rotation into your lower back. Notice how I'm rotating on my toes. That's going to help protect my knees as I rotate. Bring your feet close together and just begin swinging your arms down by your hips. As your hands pass your hips, you're going to bend your knees. And begin to bring them up. You're accelerating your arms past your hips as you're gliding up to the top. The hands and fingers are staying relaxed. You're focusing on your upper posture. Your head and neck should not change. Good, two more. All right, let's widen your stance a little bit. And put one hand on your hip and just reach over the top for a prolonged stretch. Continue to take nice deep breaths in and out. Good. Switch sides. I want about two good long breaths on each side. Good. One more time on the other side. Big stretch. Try to open up your chest. Pull your shoulder blades down and back. You should be experiencing a stretch coming down your lats, into your obliques, into the lower back. We're on our way down the body. Very good. Bring one foot forward and one foot back. I want you to roll your shoulders down and back. Feel the mobility in your shoulder blades. Really start to engage your back. All right, bring your arm up and find that balance point. Just coming up and down. Good, the chest stays up tall. Begin to lean and stretch over to that side. Good, let's switch sides. Get yourself set up, find that balance point. Side. 
last one. Well done. Straddle your legs out wide and begin to just rotate to the opposite knee. The hand comes overhead, making a straight line from your knee towards the ceiling. Just like this. Now, in order to do this, I'm sending my hips back, and I'm going to rotate so you can kind of see as my arm comes across, I'm pushing my hips behind the heels. If you need to, you can slightly bend the knees, or if your hamstrings feel okay, you can extend that leg, but never think about locking out the knees. Just like that. All right, that's the beginning of our flexibility series. I hope that you enjoyed. Stay tuned. We'll be working more floor-based exercise, opening up the hips, the quads, the glutes, and getting down into the ankles. Have a wonderful day.